Welcome back. Time now for the mix. I love my animal stories. Promised you another one. Oh, that's right. Yes. Right? I love pregnancy stories, too. Two in one. <laughs> Beluga whale pregnancy. It's over at the Georgia Aquarium. Take a look. 20-year-old Beluga Maris is pregnant. This time, a second go-round. People very optimistic about it. She had an earlier pregnancy in 2012. The first calf didn't survive, unfortunately. It's common, they say, that the first pregnancies don't necessarily take for beluga whales, both in wildlife and in captivity. But they're pretty hopeful. They say with each pregnancy that it gets better and better. She's getting state-of-the-art technology, and everybody can follow her progress on the Georgia Aquarium's blog and social media site. You love that story. Huh? I love that story. I think it's everything wrapped into one. And sometimes when I'm pregnant, I felt sort of like a whale. And oh it's good to see a real goodness. whale kind of, Gracious you know, I, I feel comfort knowing that Stop she it. also suffers, but <laughs> gets through it. And we'll have a great pregnancy. Okay, this, this is how we work here. You like the animal stories. I like the relationship stories. You Here's do. a relationship story about a proposal. Now, everybody has their proposal story, but this couple has one. He proposed to her in the back of a police car. I know, you do what you got to do sometimes, all right? Uh, here you see the couple. Now, this was after they got out of the police car, but he actually proposed beforehand. This is over in England, actually. Uh, he, they were on their way, this couple, okay. to a romantic retreat, wherever it may be. He was going to propose there. They got into an accident, hit a tree. Oh, they couldn't keep gosh. going. Police officer had to show up. The guy, they give the, the couple a, a ride. So they're in the back of the car. So he wasn't a criminal. They weren't so under arrest. He didn't steal the ring. No, he wasn't under arrest okay. for stealing anything. He was just getting a ride, but he couldn't wait. Proposed okay. to the back seat of a car. They That's eventually nice. pulled over, stopped, and proposed this way. That's but nice. you do what you got to do. Guys, we get nervous in these yeah. moments. Yeah. Oh, look at that. Okay. She said yes. And it all works out. Okay. In the back of a car. In the back of a car. Police, Police car. car at that. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> well, good luck to them. My home state of Florida mm -hmm. could possibly become. What now? Break down down to be the 51st state. North Florida and South Florida. Apparently that is something that politicians are looking at. Why? In Southern Florida, because they are worried. The mayor of South Florida and South Miami City Commission says they want a legal separation. They want a North and the South, because they are worried that the Northern part of the state isn't looking out for the Southern part of the state. And there's global warming that could affect the Southern part and possibly bring them underwater. So. This is from the That's mayor down solve. there. That's going to solve the problem. Let me tell you what Mayor Philip Stoddard said. It's very apparent that the attitude of the northern part of the state is that they would just love to saw the state in half and just let us float away into the Caribbean. It's not true. We love you guys. I'm from Tampa. <laughs> I would. I don't want to see my state break apart. We don't either. You have no. to go a lot farther to visit. No. <laughs> we'll be back. Stick with us.